Hello and welcome to the Student Kitchen. Today we're going to be making barbecue chicken and bacon with potato wedges and broccoli. For today's recipe you're going to need one chicken breast, two slices of bacon, potato, some broccoli, some barbecue sauce, some vegetable oil and some cheddar cheese. You're also going to need two baking tins. First preheat the oven to about 180 degrees. Now we're going to start on our potato wedges. To do this, first cut your potato in half and then cut three or four wedges out of each half. We're now going to add about a tablespoon of oil to our first baking tray. Make sure to cover your potato wedges in the oil so that they crisp up nice and brown. We're going to place the potato wedges at the top of the oven. We're now going to set the timer for 40 minutes. Now it's time to prep the chicken and bacon. Start off by taking one medium sized chicken breast and two rashes of bacon. We're going to start by wrapping the bacon around the larger end of the breast and then continuing that with the second piece. Be careful not to overlap your bacon as this will make it too thick and it won't crisp up as well. We're going to add about a tablespoon of oil to the bottom of our pan. This will stop the chicken from sticking to the pan. We've also lined our pan with tin foil and this saves on washing up at the end. Now it's time to create the topping. First of all we need to grate some cheese. Now you can grate as much or as little cheese as you like. This part is down to your preference. Once the chicken has been in the oven for 20 minutes we're going to take it out and this is when we'll put the cheese and barbecue sauce on top. First cover the chicken in as much or as little barbecue sauce as you like and then sprinkle your cheese on top. Now we're going to place it back in the oven for a further 10 minutes. At this point you can check on your potato wedges and maybe turn them over if they're starting to brown too much on one side. Now we need to prep the broccoli. Do this by cutting the broccoli off of the main stalk you can have as much broccoli or as little as you'd like once again. Now fill a pan halfway up with boiling water and add your broccoli. The broccoli will take 5-10 to 10 minutes to cook. Once that is all ready, it's time to plate up. As you can see our potato wedges are nice and brown and crisp and because of that bit of oil on the tray they come off quite nice and easy. Now it's time to remove the chicken. There will be some sauce left over in the bottom of the pan, now it's up to you whether you'd like to put that on top of your chicken or not. And now we're adding our broccoli. And there you have it, barbecue chicken wrapped in bacon with broccoli and potato wedges.